Hello, uh, my name is Logan Clark, and I recently just went to my new student dialogue. Uh, my new student dialogue was on interracial dating, and um, overall, our experience was a pretty good one. Um, our group was pretty active in our dialogue. A lot of people spoke up and voiced their opinion on um, inter interracial dating. Our two advisors were very good at uh, getting everything out of us. We all participated. Personally, though, I hate public speaking, so I was pretty quiet during the whole thing. But we learned a good bit in um, in interracial dating, all the different views on people having in interracial dating. Many people thought that there was a difference between a black male dating a white female and a white female dating a black male. Um, there's a difference when it comes to how families and people view them. People viewed, people thought that a black male dating, oh sorry, a white, so let me get this straight, a white, no, oh my god. Alright, I got it now. What I meant to say was a black female dating a white male. Many people view that as something that is more odd, not not as typical. They feel I feel like people often see uh, white ma white females dating black males often, especially with athletics. Many white females people say they. White females like black athletes. That's what came up in our dialogue. Um, also, um, what I thought was very interesting in our dialogue was the black people that were in the dialogue had often different opinions than the uh, white people. Often, the black people thought a little differently I thought that that they don't like getting viewed differently than white people they think that no matter what they're always getting like um, they're always getting looked at differently in everything as in when they walk into a gas station they feel like the store manager is keeping a closer eye on them um, they feel like when they walk down the street Older, the older generation looks at them as, well, as a line of slaves. Um, they feel like everything they do is, they're not, they can never be a white person. They can never be up to our standard, they said. And then the white people, it depends on often where the white people were from, their background, if they're from the north or the south. But many people often said in the dialogue that, for instance, they, if they brought home a black, female, or male, they, their parents would be very skeptical. Um, they would be not necessarily worried, but and there was a couple situations where a person in our dialogue did bring home a uh, black um, person from the opposite sex, and their parents made them break up. Um, this, I feel like, is a little absurd. I feel like if you're in love with someone, and you're in love, and that's how it should be. But the, especially in the South, slavery was huge, and many people have different views on that kind of stuff. And I respect their opinions, but you can't break up love. And love is love, and that's it. And if people are in love. You have to let them be, no matter their age or anything like that. And now my roommate is walking in. Hey, Tyro. Yep. The zombie apocalypse. And the zombie apocalypse. Um, yep. So we got 15 seconds left in this interracial dating. Procrastination. Um, zombie apocalypse. It's life and. Gotique. You know, Gotique. 
Sportique. Peace.